Lesson 1. I have read into the majority of subjects for the reason of not having the understanding why for instance why do human have no remorse to kill or let life die where if it is a human, an animal or the planet earth which lead me to the beginning of the, the book of the dead is an ancient Egyptian funerary text generally written on papyrus and used from the beginning of the new kingdom around 1550 BCE to around 50 BCE. Inspired by both the theologians of ancient Egypt composed a large number of funerary texts which were certainly in general use under the Ith dynasty about 3700 BC, and were probably well known under the first dynasty, and throughout the whole period of dynastic history Thoth was regarded as the author of the book. Thoth. Thoth, Greek, Egyptian Jati, in Egyptian religion, a god of the moon, of reckoning, of learning, and of writing. He was held to be the inventor of writing, the creator of languages, the scribe, interpreter, and advisor of the gods, and the representative of the sun god, Thoth, the god of wisdom was one of the most important deities of Egyptian gods. Thoth also known as Jhati, Dolti or Dhuti and he is the god of writing, knowledge, time, fantasy, speaking, inventions and moon. Moreover he involved in arbitration, magic and the judging of the dead. He roles of the moon god Thoth include the development of science, the arts of magic, the system of writing, arbitration and the judgment of the dead. Status, he was a mediating power between good and evil, the secretary of Ra and the scribe of the underworld. Ancient Egyptian Retainer Sacrifices Ancient Egyptian retainer sacrifice is a type of human sacrifice in which pharaohs and occasionally other high court nobility would have servants killed after the pharaoh's deaths to continue to serve them in the afterlife. The Egyptians believed that the phenomena of nature were divine forces in and of themselves. These deified forces included the elements, animal characteristics, or abstract forces. The Egyptians believed in a pantheon of gods, which were involved in all aspects of nature and human society. Exodus 1.22 Pharaoh commanded all his people to throw into the Nile and every Hebrew boy that was born to the Savak, the crocodile-headed god of whom each crocodile was an emblem. Though the theologians wrote the spell 125 the longest spell in the Book of the Dead. It is one of the key points in a person's journey into the afterlife because it represents the point where his or her life and deeds were judged. The selling of the Book of the Dead the Egyptians murdered and killed for because the though the theologians could not duplicate the manuscript fast enough, for one manuscript to be written took three or more months but there were many duplicators employed. The Egyptians believed that if they sacrificed themselves under the reading and the understanding of theologians wrote the spell they killed themselves or offer themselves for to be killed by crocodiles thinking they would have a better life or afterlife. Parents were throwing their babies and children into the crocodiles pits thinking they would have a better life. How did the spell 125 stop? Home 